Your child is going to have a video fluoroscopic swallow study, which we also call a feeding study. To prepare, we will contact you to bring in different foods. We'll prepare liquids for the study here at CHEO. Please bring anything that will help your child to eat better, such as a favorite bowl, cup, spoon, or toy. Please arrive 10 minutes before your appointment. The study will happen in our medical imaging department on the second floor, the main floor of the hospital. During the study, you'll meet a number of healthcare professionals, a medical resident, a radiologist, medical radiation technologist, nurse, and an occupational therapist. This study is a live video x-ray of your child eating and drinking. It will take between 30 and 45 minutes. During the study, you'll give your child some of the food you've brought from home, as well as the liquids that we will prepare here. We will add some barium to the food and liquids. Barium shows up on the x-ray and it allows the radiologist to see how your child swallows. We use an x-ray machine and television monitor for this study. The x-ray machine will move and shine a small red light to ensure your child is in the right position. The machine will make a sound similar to this. Before the study begins, your child will need to remove jewelry and any clothing with metal in it. We may give your child a hospital gown to wear. You'll need to stay with your child during the study. Parents and caregivers know best how to feed their children. But if you're pregnant, or think you might be, you won't be able to stay in the room. Radiation can be harmful during pregnancy. Your child will sit in a tumble form chair, a regular chair, or their own seating system. We try to have your child sit in a similar way that they would when eating at home. Your child won't be able to sit on your lap. We'll place a lead apron on your child's lap to limit radiation exposure. We'll give you a full lead apron to wear as well. The study will begin as you feed your child. We hope your child will eat as they would at home. An occupational therapist will be close by and may suggest different feeding strategies. To get the best video, your child must be facing forward and stay fairly still. We may need to limit your child's body movements. X-rays use small amounts of radiation. The amount of radiation each patient is exposed to will be different. We use the lowest radiation dose possible and the overall amount of radiation used is small. We'll speak to you about the study results when the study is over, and we'll send a report to your referring physician. Hopefully this gives you some information and helps in the preparation for the feeding study. If you have any questions or concerns, please contact us. We look forward to seeing you and your child for the feeding study.